What's up guys? My name is YouTube Jared and welcome to my show. Anyways, I just came from Walmart and I bought this um oh this thing zooms in. Cadbury Dairy Milk um chocolate here. And I don't know, it looks pretty good man. Let's just try it out. Alright, this is really melted like Pretty bad. Pretty badly melted, yo. Mmm, mmm. Tastes good though. Mm, tastes real good. Mmm. It's a wonderful day in the neighborhood. Beautiful day for a neighbor. Would you be mine? Could you be my neighbor? Right now I'm at Sam's Guys in Houston on Fannin South and South on the Freeway 69 South Loop. This is a pulled pork sandwich. I have never tried this before. It is super hot right now, so I'm gonna give it a few minutes. The camera's not doing it very much justice. This is a yogurt, ice cream yogurt, and this is a slice of pizza. This kind of pizza is uh, supreme. So this is the receipt I have gotten from here. I don't know if you guys can see it. Oh, I can't see it barely. This camera kind of just sucks. Little 6:45, anyways, for the three items. All right, guys. Uh, I'm, I don't know if I'm gonna review this one now. I'm probably gonna review it later, but I'll tell you what it was from one to ten. It's really hot, so it's gonna take a while. All right, guys. Please like, subscribe, mostly share. Peace out. The pizza was actually really good, guys, and so was the uh, the pulled pork. This is, of course, uh, when it takes when I eat cold, anything cold, it takes a long time for me to eat it because my teeth are very sensitive, my gums are very sensitive to the cold. But um, I'm gonna rate the pizza maybe like um, 6.9 and that 7.3 for the pulled pork um, pulled pork sandwich, whatever. All right, guys, hope you like it. Peace. Uh, now I'm homeless because of you guys. Homeless. So I was gonna make this whole thing called a webisode to where um you know I you know I did all this stuff which just like I was gonna make it you know I don't know what day it is and this and that and you just, but today is August 5th guys um the reason I didn't upload the last two days was because T I the truth is T took my other phones because I've been recording too much playing online all day and stuff like that so I mean I know what you're saying like yeah I need to give it a break but it's just hard you know I guess when I have the devices or whatever but I have this other phone that she, uh, she knew about but they don't it doesn't record without a microchip so when I got a microchip for it but mm. I'm just not gonna record when she's there because you know she, she doesn't like me doing all the phone stuff she doesn't think that this phone that can record mm. so um I'm gonna upload this video today it's August 5th right now it's really early in the morning this isn't the best quality camera, to the truth though. But I mean, it's better than nothing, right? I want to. I'll be telling you like right for Crave Carnet. I didn't recording because of the. It's five fifty three in the morning. It is August fifth, twenty sixteen. So it's basically six o'clock. Um, I can't download any, any, any apps app gaming right now because I don't have the, uh, the uh, Samsung phone to record that um, uh, but yeah before Crave kind of day or two before I'm gonna have a, my phone so I'm gonna try and post more videos in and so well I'm gonna still post videos on this phone I'm just saying I'm gonna post them with the other phones um, day or two before CraveCon so but yeah 
all right guys uh peace uh peace out like subscribe mostly share sharing is caring guys peace out another thing i want to say guys is if you've seen the video i think under the subtitle topic eating at subway i got a p.o box and i'm gonna be putting the p.o box in all my videos now i'm a, I've been forgetting, you know, I think I think one or two videos, but that's because I'm not used to having a P.O. Box, guys. It's the first time I've ever had a P.O. Box, and I got it mostly for fan mail and for people who won't jack my stuff when I order, like, boxes here. Because you have boxes outside and stuff, people take your stuff because they, they don't care. They're homeless people. And, um, yeah, so, anyways, let me show you, let me show you the P.O. Box. And all fan mail is subject to be on the vlog. So if you send something, you know, it's probably going to be on the vlog. Because I like recording everything. Okay, so the box number is 20329, uh, Houston, Texas, 77225. I'm going to put it in the description of this video. Alrighty. And that's that. I'm going to make some spaghetti right now. It's still like 6 in the morning right now. Uh, yeah. Because mm. I don't know if you remember. Um, I keep forgetting because every time I would upload videos on my other phone. I, I mean, every time I record something on the phone, I, on the phone I upload it. And my other phones, I don't know where they are. I think they're somewhere in the closet. But um, I had pasta and I recorded. My, I was in the middle of making spaghetti and stuff. But... Tia's not here right now, honestly. She went to work, so. Alright. These are some cookies I got from Walmart yesterday. Um, ultimate white chunk macadamia nut. So that's cool. They're gonna be real good if you put them in the oven. Oh, I got a bunch of stuff. This is the stuff I ate yesterday at Sam's pulled pork, barbecue burger, and pizza, and the other thing, Walmart stuff I bought, and this is the spaghetti, the thin one I'm going to cook with, we can make some of these heated up in the oven, and here we have the rest of the marinara sauce, and the other stuff, sauces link. All right, so I'm gonna start getting everything prepared. So I'm gonna put this on Royal. Wait, no, this. One. Yeah, well, I gotta turn it on. Yeah, so this one is no. This one here. Let's put it on like three for right now. So that's my one. So my brother, I think my mom made him to the cycle yesterday. But anyways, he got a deal. You guys know. Um, but now I think he said he's going back because for like a year, I think, because he messed up his probation and all this stuff, so, I mean, I'm not a loss for words, I don't know what to tell, like, dude, like, I mean, it's his own fault, number one, and if you're watching this, Ryan, I mean, you gotta behave, man, that's all you have to do, you try, you know, try not to do drugs, <laughs> I don't, just try and, like, you know, be calm, like, what helps me be calm is the, the, the online, like, if it wasn't for technology and stuff, I don't know what I would be doing right now, I just, I have like the same, I don't know, I have to be doing something, for him, for you, you gotta work out, that's what you do, you work out, and you like, you know, I show you how to do YouTube, if you guys don't know my brother's channel, check it out, Ryan Chase Hunt, I put a Vegeta in there on the, on the cover, R-Y-A-N-C-H-A-S-O-N, um, if you guys like, ask him, maybe he could do some videos in jail, I don't know, in the psych ward, or not even the psych ward, <laughs> <laughs> it sounds funny, but man, life can be harsh, man. Like we are, you gotta. I mean, the best of your ability is just stay in your zone. I mean, stay in your. You know, you gotta be right, be right in your head, man. Because I know it's hard, especially if you're higher intelligence. Uh, your, you know, your your mind is more out there. Um. Uh, so I'm gonna put this on boil, like I said, and then uh, I'm gonna. I need two hands for this, but I'm gonna get these and open them up and. Uh, I'm only going to throw half of them in and cut it half, throw half in. Alright guys, so I put some in here. Uh, I'm going to put this in here for later days. Later days, man. 
But yeah, man, like, seriously, like, you, you did, you caused this to yourself, like, no one else is to blame but you, like, you're your own worst enemy, I'm my own worst enemy, like, you have to fight, always, always. The moment you stop fighting, that's when you start going down. Like, same thing with working out, the moment you start working out, that's when you start getting weaker, automatically. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Don't let me down, down, down. <laughs> um, so anyways, right now I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to chop, cut some of this up and get my knife and cut this up in there. Ooh, the sausage is cut up. If you're wondering what kind of sausage uh, this is or was, home smokehouse pecan smoked sausage jalapeno, gluten free. But yeah, bro, um, I'm talking to Ryan still. Like, if you ever see this video, remember what you told me and Dina when you got out of jail? Our best, uh, your, your best friend Ralph, like, we hang out with a guy called Ralph, right? He's in jail for 10 years, like, everybody that, when you came out of jail, everybody that you, uh, you knew, when you went in, either dead or in jail, remember? Everybody, look, I, I've seen documentaries of people that do heroin, dude. They're all dead or in jail. It's the same thing. So you, you're not, you wasn't lying. I know what you're talking about. You got to stray from this path, man, especially a path of drugs. You got to find a different outlet. If you keep doing the same thing, you're going to get the same results. It's not just a theory of, of craziness. Craziness. It's Einstein's theory for insanity, but it's something else. It's a lot more things than that. You're going to get the same results. It is what it is. You know, you got to change. Um... So, I don't know how much done these are. I'm going to go ahead and stir them up, but look, they're not even stirrable. So, I just put them higher temperature, so I have to wait on those. And then I'm going to dump these in. I'm going to dump those in once I get the water out of here. Then I'm going to put that. And then I'm going to put the sausage link pieces. And then after that, we're going to eat this. I'm going to put it in the oven. Uh, but yeah, another thing I was going to say... Um, like, uh, I was thinking like last night about a bunch of people, um, you know, I go through different phases all the time. I got problems too. Everybody got, has problems, you know, it sounds cliche, but everyone has problems, you know? Um, but anyways, that's how I was thinking about cousin Charlie, you know, Aaron, cousin Aaron, you know, the, the Garzas and a lot of people and, you know, I was like, well, you know, well, sometimes you're never going to see them again. You're never going to see some people again that you loved in the past or that your your family, um, you know. Uh, and I used to get along, we used to get along really good with uh, some other family members. And, you know, we don't hang out anymore. We don't talk anymore. So, you know, don't take things for what they seem because they're always going to change. The only constant in life is change. The only thing that's going to happen is change. Things are going to change. That's the only consistent in life is change. So, I was talking to Kyle yesterday. He's uh, He watches my channel. He comments on like all my videos. And he said, you know, because I, I, he was at the at Game Con, you know, in Galveston, Texas, a few months, like a month ago. Or this month. <laughs> yeah, this month, I think. And he was like, yeah, I said, how come you're wearing that? What are you wearing? Because it looks like he's wearing long hair, but because he's, he's in the front of a... Uh, he said Dame or Ken, uh, Ken's gaming channel, and uh, he's wearing this thing. And I said, what is it? Like, he said, it's a monkey hat. It's a monkey hat. And he said, he said it'll help them remember me better, which is not a bad thing. Don't get me wrong. How, how people remember you better is not a bad thing. But I used to think kind of like, like that, too. Like, oh, I want these people to remember me. But there's higher consciousness in this world. There's higher, way higher consciousness than... Damon Ken. I'm not hating on Damon. I'm not bashing on Damon Ken either. They're awesome guys. They're really cool. I'm like super excited to go to Paracon and meet them and be in their vlogs and whatnot. But they're not going to remember you. Especially when they pass. I'm going to pass. You're going to pass. We're all going to pass. Uh, and then the memory is gone. Poof. That's why I don't care what people think. Don't get me wrong. I do care what people think. But it's not going to last. Think about it like that. It's not going to last. This YouTube video I'm making right now is going to last longer and more crisp than any of our thoughts are right now because we're just not at that level yet. You see what I'm saying?
the more the if you want people to remember you, be the best version of yourself. Like, I'm gonna go out here. I want you know. I want them to remember you. You gotta. You, you want people to know who you are. You have to remember you. Be a better version of you. You know what I'm saying? Uplift who you are. Invest in you. Invest in you. Invest in your knowledge. Invest in your ability. Of invest in your understanding and wisdom. Then you become a better version of yourself. But anyways, check this out. This here is almost done. Cause it's really getting softer. I was gonna give it like maybe because I could tell I can still tell it's kind of hard without biting one. So I'm gonna give it a few more minutes in there, by guys, buys, <laughs> buys. But yeah, I love having fun all the time. I love laughing all the time. A lot of things are tragic. Comedy is close to tragedy. You know, a lot of things are funny. They're messed up, but <laughs> they become funny because it's so stupid. It's, it's random. You know, it's whatever. But yeah. Some of the things I'm saying right now, like being all insp inspirational and all this stuff, you know, I'm I'm really not a serious guy. Like 90% of the time, I'm not serious. You know, I'm trying to help my brother out, but there's no way I can see insight that I can. It's in a lot of situations that you cannot help. You can't. You can't help the way you look, the way you're born, your genetics, and stuff like that. I know. I might sound right now maybe like Ty Lopez or something, but I'm way more fun than Ty Lopez. Like, Ty Lopez is cool, don't get me wrong, and he's got like a ton of money. But on a fun level, I'm up here and Ty Lopez down here. I'm like, I'm way fun, you know that. If you know me at all. <laughs> if I had that kind of money, man, I would have so much fun, man. I want... I, I was thinking the other day I want a swimming pool, right, if I had a good amount of money. And I want a rock climbing thing inside the swimming pool going up. So like if I fall or something, I just hit the I just hit the pool, you know. But you know, that sounds really fun. But yeah, this is pretty much done right now. Check out the water from the spaghetti or the lasagna. It is called straining, guys. Um, I took out I mean the water right now, strained it, uh, I just added the sausage. And you gotta be careful because when you pour the manure manure <laughs> marinara sauce onto this like really fast and this is really hot and that's really cold it might make the lasagna i mean the pasta lasagna whatever hard or a different texture so what i do is you got to put it lower first add the sausage cool it down another another level because the sausage wasn't is a uh, you know still at room temperature actually refrigerator temperature so that lowered it then you're going to add the sauce All right, let's go ahead and mix it in. Almost lunch time, guys. It's almost lunch time. Yes, sir. All that eating out. I got my stove, my oven cooked fix. Oh, man, I spilled some. Some for the roaches right there. <laughs> nah, we're, I'm gonna clean it up. Don't you worry, we gonna we gonna get that. Ah, it's hot. I'm trying to get to the bottom, but it's really hard. I'm gonna eat it like that. I'm gonna clean this. I need two hands right now, guys. Thank you. All right, guys, it is done. Um, I don't have fast motion on this device, so I'm just gonna rate it and then I'm gonna eat the rest off camera so let's see here mm. I, mean, I didn't clean it enough with the sauce and stuff but it is good it is good even like that, it tastes so good, like, I don't know. I'm going to rate it still. An 8.3. Peace out, guys. Like, subscribe, mostly share. Hope to see you at CraveCon, Galveston, Texas. Yeah! Guys, and also let me know in the comments if you want me to dye my hair this light green color for CraveCon. 
All right. Uh, yeah.